Hi, welcome to the Whitney Museum of American Art, where we'll be making our own artworks inspired by pieces in the museum's collection. My name is Laura, and today we're going to make our own six-sided self-portraits inspired by this sculpture, Women and Dog, by Marisol. Marisol is best known for her sculptures of people. She made them using techniques like wood carving, painting, and collage. She also included real objects like strollers and shoes. All four life-size painted wood female figures in this artwork are self-portraits of the artist. One figure features her photograph. Two others include plaster casts of the artist's face, and the smaller one has a drawing of her as a child. Marisol included a real purse, a hair bow, and a taxidermy dog's head in this sculpture. Today, we are going to explore the many sides of our own personalities and all the pieces that make us who we are. Now let's create our own self-portraits. Here are the materials and tools we will need. First, we'll need paper and pencil for brainstorming. We'll need a small box. This could be any old box you got in the mail. Small tissue boxes work well if you want each side to be similar in size. We will need scissors and something sticky like glue or tape. Whatever collage materials you have lying around, including any family photos you're allowed to transform into artwork. You can always add images and words from old newspapers or magazines. We will need drawing utensils like Sharpies or markers. And always remember to cover your table with some newspaper or plastic to protect the surface from messy materials. Grab your sheet of paper and draw a few lines to create six spaces on your page. You don't need to be too careful or tidy. This is just to help us brainstorm. Fill each of the sections on your page with something that makes you, you. What are the things you love? What are the activities you enjoy? Who do you like to spend time with? What are some qualities that make up your personality? What are some of the traditions you share with your family and friends? Spend some time sketching or writing to explore the many sides of who you are. Our self-portraits don't need to look exactly like us. Sometimes they communicate important things about ourselves that other people wouldn't know just from looking at us. Now, use your drawing as a guide to transform your regular box into a six-sided self-portrait. If your box is just plain cardboard or a tissue box, you might wanna cover it in paper or something easy to draw on or you can just make the drawings separately and attach them to the box. On each face of the box, create a collage or drawing that represents one part of who you are. Cut shapes out of your collage materials and photographs to glue and tape them onto your box. You definitely have many more parts of your personality that can fit on one little box, so which ones will you choose? Thanks for joining us to make six-sided self-portraits. We'd love to see your work, so share your creations with us using the hashtag WhitneyKids or email us at familyprograms at whitney.org. Check out our website for a complete list of our programs for families. And don't forget that kids under 18 always get in free at the Whitney, so come visit us soon. Bye.